Introduction On a bright Sunday morning of December, Shreya is sitting in her lawn. She watches that the gardener is mowing the lawn. Shreya wonders if it is possible to find out how much surface the gardener covered while mowing the lawn. She also wants to know if the boundary of the lawn has another name in mathematics. In this lesson, we will discuss areas and perimeters. Objectives At the end of this lesson, you will be able to Calculate area by counting Calculate area using a formula Calculate area using a geoboard Calculate perimeter using a formula Area the rectangular front lawn of Shreya's house is a two-dimensional figure with a length and a breadth. The total surface covered by a two-dimensional figure is known as its area. A square, you may recall, is a two-dimensional figure whose length is equal to its breadth. Consider a square of length one unit. The area of a square is length into length. Therefore, the area of the square with length 1 unit is 1 into 1, which is equal to 1 unit square. Just as there is a unit of measurement of length, there is a unit of measurement of area as well. We measure lengths in centimeters or meters. Similarly, we measure areas in centimeter or meter square. Finding area by counting number of square blocks. Now, Let's calculate the area of the given figure that contains five square blocks. The length of each square block is one unit. We know that the area of one square block of one unit length is one unit square. So the area of the complete figure of five square blocks, each of length one unit, is one unit square plus one unit square plus one unit square plus 1 unit square plus 1 unit square. It can also be written as 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1, which is equal to 5 into 1, which equals 5 unit square. Now let us calculate the area of a figure that is made up of square blocks, each of length 3 centimeters. The area of each square block of length 3 centimeter is 3 into 3, which is equal to 9 cm square. Now count the square blocks. They are 5 in number. So the area of the figure can be calculated as the number of square blocks multiplied by the area of one square block. Therefore, the area is 5 into 9 is equal to 45 cm square. Finding area when length and breadth are given. The area of a square is length into length. Square is a special rectangle whose length and breadth are equal. Now consider a rectangle which is not a square. The length of the rectangle is 6 cm and breadth is 7 cm. Let us find its area. Area of the rectangle is equal to length into breadth, which is equal to 6 into 7, which equals 42 cm square. Finding area using geoboard. Have you ever seen a geoboard? Look at this figure. This is a geoboard. A geoboard is created by placing dots in rows and columns. The distance between any two adjacent dots should be the same. Let's learn to calculate the area of the given figure using a geoboard. First, draw five lines of lengths, 5 cm, 4 cm, 2 cm, 1 cm and 1 cm on paper as shown in the figure. The distance between any two adjacent dots in the geoboard is 1 cm. Join the dots to create a closed figure. Now, join all the dots inside the figure horizontally and vertically to form square blocks as shown in the figure. It is now time to count all the square blocks. The area of each square block is 1 cm square. The area of the complete figure is equal to the number of square blocks multiplied by the area of one square block, that is, 17 into 1 
is equal to 17 cm square perimeter. The total distance around a two-dimensional figure is known as its perimeter. In other words, perimeter of a two-dimensional figure is the length of its boundary. Finding perimeter. Perimeter of a rectangle. If L is the length of a rectangle and B its breadth, the perimeter of the rectangle is equal to L plus B plus L plus B is equal to 2 into L plus 2 into B. Perimeter of a square. Square, you may recall, is a special rectangle whose length and breadth are equal. If A is the length of one side of a square, then its perimeter is equal to A plus A plus A plus A, which is equal to 4 into A. Perimeter of a triangle. Triangle, as you are aware, is a three-sided figure. If A, B and C are the three sides of a triangle, then its perimeter is equal to a plus B plus C. Let's learn to calculate the perimeter of the given figure. To calculate perimeter of this figure, we simply add the lengths of all its sides, which is 2 plus 6 plus 8 plus 2 plus 3 plus 5 plus 4 equals 32 centimeter. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. To calculate area by counting, using standard formula, using the geoboard. To calculate perimeter by counting, using formula.